Welcome to the Sweet Chili Games channel where we've got a brand new series and let me tell you, it's an absolute banger. We're going to check if a game's a good game, a god game, or a dog game. We're going to be playing it for two hours, give an honest review, and at the end of it, Steam refund it. The first thing I want to talk about is the look and the feel of the game. I actually really love the look of the game and on this tutorial island, it's got that June sort of vibe to it. It's sick. You can see me stuffing up a little bit here. Man, I just couldn't get past this. Could anyone else? The aliens actually look so good. I love the design and the detail that they put into them and how smooth they are when they're like running at you. All the different features of the aliens I thought was really cool from what I saw in this tutorial and in the games that I played. Along with the design of the aliens, I'm so happy that they nailed the Stormship Trooper vibes. I actually love that movie. And I'm so happy that the game did it justice. My ship's name is called Judge of Judgment, which I thought was pretty funny. But now let's talk about some pitfalls about the look and feel. I couldn't actually run the game on full graphics and I have a mid-tier computer. So that's actually something to keep in mind when considering to buy the game. If you don't have the best of computers, then yeah, you're going to have to run it with some like low graphic settings. Other than that, when I had my graphics on low, I had really good performance. And I'm going to show the results of my review at the end of the video. So let's continue on into the gameplay segment. This is one of the bigger battles I had. And at this point, I thought the game was solo. So I was just missioning in here doing this raid. And I actually had so much fun here. Look at all the bits and pieces that are going on. I love how active it was and how you had to watch your ammo, but then you also got your full resupplies and everything. Is that the brood commander? That looks like a brood. Okay, we're gonna we've got the plan. We've got the plan. We've got the plan. We're gonna go down, down. Oh no, we're not. We're gonna go right, right up. Okay? Right, right up. He's striking! We gotta get out of here. Oh my god, I just I just, I just killed myself. Oh I shit. actually had no idea you respawned. And I'm actually having so much fun here. Oh dodged him. Oh. oh, that's some serious Starship Trooper vibes. Just pump them. <laughs> now let's get into the gameplay review. I felt like the gunplay was so smooth and I loved the pistol. It just felt like a mini sniper with a really fulfilling hit and kill animations. Calling the reinforcements was also really satisfying. Just like boom and down it comes from the mothership. I thought that was a really sick concept. So that was the pros, the weapon design, the gunplay and calling the reinforcements. A pitfall for the gameplay is that it's kind of matching that monster hunter type of gameplay where you go in with your little squad. I'm sure you can do this. But like I would rather play the game solo and I have actually seen videos about that out there so it's not really a pitfall. Overall for the gameplay I'm going to give it four stars. For the look and feel I'm also going to give it four stars. So would I recommend it? Absolutely. I actually had so much fun playing the game and I would highly recommend it to anyone looking to play a bit of a bang em up, shoot em up game with, with no real pressure. So here we go. We've played the game, reviewed the game, giving it 8 stars out of 10. And now, Steam refund it. I hope you all loved the video as much as I loved making it. My next video is going to be on Enshrouded, my next play review refund. So please subscribe and I'll see you there.